well, there's hardly anybody here. And I got here and I thought, I've got the wrong day. And um, I'm not the only person that thought that, but no, apparently we've got very few people going. It was just a lack of signs, that was all. And I thought, oh no. cover off and your stirrup covers off. Wait. Wait, Apollo, wait. Hello. Walk on. Walk on, Apollo. Good boy. Come on. crowing and bird song. I hope it picks up on the camera because it's quite nice to have that as a little background and then Apollo Apollo shoes on the hard ground he's got his grey well, silver bow silver and gold bow on today is Apollo and not me. <laughs> ah, yes. <laughs> now, so they're saying it's six miles today. decent arrows because there's nobody about. <laughs> I really thought we'd come on the wrong day. I did honestly and um, there was nobody at the gate. Last time I came here with Farouk there was somebody on the gate and they directed you where to go. Today nothing. Nobody, no official, nobody checking to see if you've arrived or I don't know, a bit, uh, bit odd. Hopefully we don't park company because we might not get found, might we? If there's not many people riding past us and the organisers don't even know whether we've arrived or not. There's an arrow, so that's excellent, and we seem to have a little grass field to canter in, so that's nice. Oh, maybe not, no, it's, we have to keep to the side, okay. <laughs> but that's all right, because it's still grass, so that's good. And there's a nice uh, river there. I'll just go down and we can have a look.
just slightly turn the corner and it's so windy and I don't mean a pothole. Well, I hope you can see that look. Hello, where are you going? <laughs> no, go on. I don't know. What was all that? Hey, what was all that? Red arrow. Now, does that mean it will go around this way? <laughs> I think we had this last time. I think it comes back onto the same track. Oh yes. Nice little log there for jumping. Wonder if I probably will jump that without having me off. At it anyway. I don't think we will, because if I come off and there's nobody about, we could be in trouble. Couldn't we, Apollo? Not that I think he would run off and leave me, but I'm um, not going to risk it. Too few people on this ride. Turn a lot. Okay, come to then. <laughs> that jump anyway. Not that I'd be jumping, but I wouldn't jump that. Looks a mess. Very quiet, no traffic noise. All you can hear is the, the rapids of the river. was him really I was thinking counter and he just did so you know, I must have given up some indication that I was going to say something or uh, use the leg or something because he just went did you <laughs> I think I was much fitter than I gave him credit for when we had those two months off I think it's because he gets a lot of exercise in the field with the other horses change legs then. That was interesting. So I was prying my right leg just to keep him away from the edge and then he just changed his lead from his right lead to his left lead. So that was quite interesting. I think he's, I think we could uh, practice a bit more of that lead changing. Because he seems to have remembered it from when I was starting to teach him before um, I gave him to Renz. He 
works is the camera goes geese on that fire banking. It's a shame that <laughs> no no no. Whoa, good boy. Um it's a shame that um the camera is not very powerful. I'm sure one day we'll have the same size of camera but more zoomability. Funny word that I think I probably made that up. <laughs> Those of you that don't get our newsletter, I've entered Apollo into a Frisian parade, which is a great Yarmouth. Bit of a drive in the box uh, for me, because I only go about an hour, maximum sort of hour and a half, and I think this is... It's four hours to our bed and breakfast. Ike is going to his favourite kennels, Derrings. And Anne's going to check that Bella and Farouk are fine in the field. And um, Apollo's got his own stable and paddock at the same place as we have the bed and breakfast. So that's going to be excellent. And we're going to go for four nights. The blossom's out, isn't it lovely? When spring comes, it's just such a nice feeling. Stand there, follow, just so they can see this. No, stand. I can feel you're going to move. Stand. Stand, Apollo. No, come on. I know it's a bit funny because I'm asking you to go into a tree, but I'm not really asking you to put your head into the tree, am I? Stand. Good boy. Oh, some bluebells in the woods. The bluebells go all the way up the hill. Lovely. Post there. Up, come to, up, up. Good boy. If you've enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon. We love reading the comments, we love emojis, and we'd love a thumbs up. If you would like to catch up on some of our older videos, just click on the Apollo icon, which will take you to our home page. We have over 1700 videos to choose from, and you can sort by the most popular the oldest or the newest. Thanks for watching.
TTFN.